hi lovely welcome to my youtube channel my name is mercy if you're coming across my channel for the very first time hello thank you very very much for stopping by please subscribe to my youtube channel if you haven't done so already in this video i'm going to show you how i made this beautiful pouch it's quite spacious it can contain literally anything you need to go for a walk okay now if you want to see how i made this beautiful pouch just sit back relax and enjoy the video so i've cut out two pieces of fabrics and two pieces of lining the measurement is length eight inches and width nine inches okay and then i've got my zipper my zipper is eight inches and then this other little fabric length is 10 inches and then one inch or one and a half inches by the width. So I grab this fabric and then place it this way with my zipper facing upwards and then the fabric facing downwards. Then I pin it down and then I'm going to take it to the sewing machine and sew along. After sewing that, this is what I have. When you open it up, this is it. So I'm going to fold it over again this way and then do the same thing. Place it this way, place my lining, place my zipper facing upwards, then the fabric with the right side facing downwards like this and then I'm going to take it to the sewing machine and sew along as well. After that, this is what I have. Can you see that? Okay, when you open it up, this is what you're going to have. Can you see that? Take that aside and then I'm going to grab this fabric, fold it over and then sew along. So after sewing it, uh, what I'm going to do next, I grab this one, then run a stitch at the top. Okay, this is it. I've done that. Can you see how beautiful it is? Open it up. This is what we have. Okay, so grab this piece and then grab my safety pin and then turn it to the right side. After turning it to the right side, just take it to the iron and iron it down nice and flat. So I've done that and this is what I have. I'm going to grab this piece and then open the zipper just to allow us to turn it to the right side after sewing, okay? So when I grab the bag, I fold it this way, main fabric to main fabric and lining to lining. Remember to open the zipper before you start sewing, okay? So I'm going to place this little piece this way. It's going to serve as, as the handle or maybe just had the handle basically so just pin it down that way okay adjust it nicely and pin down okay so what I'm going to do next I'm going to start sewing from that point all the way down all the way okay so I'm gonna leave about one and a half to two inches on sewed at this point okay and then continue my sewing up until the other end remember we still have there open okay so this is the sewing so after sewing it this is what we have can you see that it's very nicely sewn so this is the place we left on sewed. Can you see that? I'm just going to grab my scissors and cut off the sharp corners. Cut off the edges this way, okay? So that we can have the bag pointed. You can have the edges pointed once we turn it to the right side, okay? So just turn it to the right side through the place we left on sewed. All right? Okay. So that done, I'm... Um, just grabbed my pencil just grab any pointed object to poke out the edges okay adjust it nicely can you see what we have can you see that it's so beautiful I told you it's very easy to make okay can you see that right so what we're going to do next is we're going to take this to the sewing machine and close up the opening we left earlier okay close it up you can do it with your hand stitch or sewing machine i've done that already can you see what we have so flip that in and then we are done we are done 
how beautiful it is now you can make use of any length you want you can make it smaller you can make it bigger but i'm just going to stick to this length of fabric and width of fabric because it's just so perfect for me so thank you very much for watching this video if you totally enjoyed it give it a thumbs up let me know what you think in the comment section subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already thank you so much bye